Hello, good evening everybody. So this isn't my normal time to go live, but I wanted to. Um, and what I want to talk about, as you can tell by the title, is the, uh, it's called the Herxheimer Reaction, also known as a healing crisis. Um, and so I get a lot of people asking me if we have, or if there is, any side effects from CBD oil. Okay, our little hemp barks is a little baby sample, so cute. Um, the answer is most people do not have adverse reactions to CBD oil. However, anytime you introduce something that is uh, organic and really pure, like the oil from our hemp, um, sometimes you can have what's called a Herxheimer reaction. So what actually happens is, and I will list the article, I'm not making it up, what actually happens is when the body tries to eliminate toxins um, at a faster rate than they can be disposed of, sometimes you will get a temporary increase of symptoms of what you're trying to get rid of. So if you take our CBD oil to help with anxiety or to help with uh, pain or you know anything like that, Sometimes those symptoms can seem to be a little bit worse when you start the oil, okay? That's because your body is not used to the oil and the um, natural like cleansing that it can do to your body. If your body is full of toxins, the CBD oil is going to react as a cleansing agent and it's going to start getting rid, it's, it's trying to get rid of all that garbage that's in your body. So that's what happens um, sometimes, very rarely, called the Herxheimer reaction. So toxins uh, can be from uh, an array of things. It can be from the things that we drink, the things that we eat, the things that, basically the things that we consume, you know, alcohol, if people smoke, um, medications, they're full of toxins. Medications, uh, you know, you're not, you're, make, you're taking something that's, you know, uh, made in a lab and that's not always natural or organic or pure or really good for your body, right? So uh, lots of times prescription medications, although um, we think they're doing really good for us, uh, are, are just pumping us full of toxins. Um, and I'm not saying, you know, that I'm blaming anybody for taking medications. Obviously, lots of people have to, um, although this is an alternative to some of them. So uh, it also can be from things that we put on our skin. So for me, that's why I'm, I'm really um, adamant about using like organic and vegan um, and um, natural, you know, soaps and lotions and things without dyes in them because over 90% of what we put on our skin gets absorbed into our bloodstream, right? So if we're using lotion and soaps and shampoos that are full of things that we can't even pronounce 99% of the time it's not good for our complete body in general right so the Herxheimer reaction or the healing crisis is the result of every bottom body system going into concert right so going into homeostasis basically is what they mean by um, in concert and they're working to eliminate waste products through all elimination channels and set the stage with regeneration. So this is really cool. The end result is that old tissues are replaced with new. So when any treatment or cleansing program causes a large scale die off of bacteria, a significant amount of endotoxins, also known as toxins within the bacteria itself can result uh, or can be released, excuse me, into the body. So the more bacteria that's present, the stronger the endotoxins, the stronger the cleansing reaction. So, you know, I know uh, one person um, that I that has taken our CBD oil actually felt like nauseous and had like some flu-like symptoms. Here's what you do. Okay, actually, hang on. Another person actually, uh, their headaches got worse. Um, and the one other person felt like their anxiety may have been a little bit worse than what it was before taking the oil, okay? So it's important because the CBD oil is cleansing your system. It's getting rid of all of the garbage that's in it. Uh, it's important to not stop the CBD oil 
what's important to do is to continue using it, but just decrease your dosage, uh, dosage, excuse me, significantly. So even if like what we typically recommend is someone start at five drops twice a day or a quarter of a drop or twice a day, some people can actually feel benefits from, benefits, uh, from like three drops a day. And I actually had one of the people that I was talking about was only taking three drops a day and she was feeling some of these um, symptoms. And so she just, she cut it back even more and took it less a day. And then all of a sudden, the problems and the symptoms that she was trying to get rid of by using the CBD oil started to decrease. So that's all you have to do. Uh, it, it's really quite amazing. It's not a bad thing. It, it, it feels bad because we're using this oil to get rid of these symptoms and all of a sudden um, they may not have gone anywhere. They may heighten, right? But that's because your body, the CBD oil is pushing out all these toxins at a rate that it's not able to necessarily get rid of that fast because it's not used to getting rid of them. It's used to having those toxins in it, right? So um, if you experience the Herxheimer reaction or the healing crisis, which it's also known as, don't stop taking your oil, just reduce your oil. Any questions, give me a call. Bye guys.